Hi, fire signs, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, each zodiacs are going to have their own readings, one zodiac at a time. We will start with Aries. So Aries, this is your deck. For those of you who is new to the channel, don't forget to click the subscribe button, smash the like button, comment down below, and don't forget to hit the notification bell. For I am doing live sessions, and during the live session, you can ask me questions. And if in case that you missed the live sessions, you can still ask me questions. There is a link in the description box. Click the link. You will be routed to my page. Type in your questions and then click submit. And if you want to book a personal reading, there's also a link in the description box. So, Aries, <clears throat> I think that you came to a realization that I'm always giving abundance to my person. I always put myself um, in the last of the list. Now, this is the time for me to kind of, why not put myself first, right? Why not um, kind of self-love is here, um, more of... I want to focus on myself or focus on um, having a new goal, right? With a ton of cups, nine of swords, four of wands, the judgment, and the nine of wands. Um, at first, it felt like, okay, the love is here, but it's more of I am having a hard time to create or achieve stability in here so i think that there is a either opening myself up right since i cannot have that for now or i cannot really have that is what someone else has thought let's say that is um person a right now they made a decision of why not kind of deprived the other person or kind of took back some of the um, abundance that I provided or some of the abundance that I give to this person um, nine of swords is in here three of Pentacles and the king of chalice someone probably thought person a probably thought that you know what I think that my person is not ready yet um, we're not on the same page because what I wanted is like real commitment in here. However, my person feels like uh, they are just here um, for the sake of having someone beside them. But the essence of real commitment is not here. Five of Wands, um, Queen of Swords, and the Tower. I think there is a lot of fights right now, right? more of it's either i feel like i am competing always with another energy it could be someone else's or competing with um your hobby competing with yourself competing with my person right um and i don't like that right why do i have to kind of force someone to give me the abundance um, the Magician is here and the Eight of um, Swords, but I think that this person cannot let you go. Wanting to still be with you, Queen of Pentacles and the Six of Swords. It felt like to me the reason why they want you is because you are very generous of your energy. And they want that with the Eight of Coins in here and a Ten of Coins. There is... <coughs> there's some sort of... Let's say, there's an effort that will be given by person B to person A, just not to let person A go. Um, but will this going to be a lasting commitment that they are going to, or are they going to be committed to always give this abundance? I can see here that it will be somehow... But let's check some other details of it in the few days. So, Aries, this is your reading. 
Um, the zodiac signs that I am seeing in here could be a placement in your chart, your person, sun sign, or a placement in their chart. Um, of course, Taurus, uh, so Sagittarius, uh, Leo, Taurus. I, I think Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn is here. So Leo, Libra, water placements, Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces. So did I say Sagittarius? Yes. So that is your reading. Thank you so much. Love and light to you. Uh, let's proceed to Leo. Leo, this is your deck. Leo, for those of you who's new to the channel, don't forget to click the subscribe button, smash the like button, comment down below, and don't forget to hit the notification bell for I am doing live sessions. And during the live, you can ask me questions. If in case that you missed the live sessions, you can still ask me questions. There is a link in the description box. Click the link. You will be routed to my page. Tap in your questions and then click submit. If you want to book a personal reading, there's also a link in the description box. So, Leo. It felt like that someone is going to approach you, really interested in you, or you're interested to someone, and it felt like that person is going to kind of reciprocate the emotion. Um, I think that they are really intrigued with your beauty, with your aura, with your energy per se. It kind of like really attracts them. There is a magnetic attraction in here, uh, strongly, if I may say, with the moon card, eight of chalice, the Death card, Knight of Swords, and the Three of Wands. I think there is a sense of urgency in here. I think that you have, or you had, um, kind of like a taste how this person um, loved like. I think that it could be an ex. Or a person that you shared some moments it didn't come to fruition I think there is some blurriness um, or fights or disagreement that happen and I think that this is kind of like a revival of the energy that was on pause um, I think that this was just on pause not really the separation separation um, even though that you were separated then um, whether it is physical or energetic, their heart still beats for you. They're kind of like still longing to be with you and to revive this connection. They kind of like just waited for the right time. All right, with a King of Pentacles in here and the Nine of Chalice, I think that your wish is going to be fulfilled. What is that wish? For their abundance to be offered. And I think that they're going to do that. Queen of Pentacles in here. Ace of Swords. And a Queen of Wands. I think that there will be an intimate moment. That's going to happen in here. There is an offer. I will be verbal and vocal. When it comes to this connection. I think that way then. It kind of like their statue. Right? They're, they're, they're not talking, they're not moving. So this time, it kind of a like same vessel, you know, same person. But with the, the, the energy is kind of like reversed, right? Um, they're going to be more cooperative. Uh, three of swords in here and a king of pentacles. So that is your issue. Them not providing the abundance. So like what I mentioned here, there is a promise. Now that you are back together, you can see and feel the changes. You're, you can, you're going to observe them. So this is your reading Leo. The zodiac signs that I am seeing in here could be a placement in your chart. Your person's sun sign or a placement in their chart. Leo, Pisces, uh, Libra, Taurus. There's a lot of Leos in here. Water placements, Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces. So Pisces is a dominant. Scorpio 2 and Leo 2. 
So you might be connecting with the same sign. So this is your reading. Thank you so much. Love and light to you. Namaste. See you on the next reading. And let's proceed to Sagittarius. Thank you. Sagis, this is your deck. Sagis. For those of you who's new to the channel, don't forget to click the subscribe button. Smash the like button, comment down below. Don't forget to hit the notification bell for I am doing live sessions. And during the live, you can ask me questions. And if in case that you miss the live sessions, you can still ask me questions. There is a link in the description box. Click the link, you will be routed to my page. Type in your questions and then click submit. If you want to book a personal reading, there's also a link in the description box. So, Sagis, <clears throat> I think that what you're doing here is, let's say you have an ideal person, right? An ideal man, ideal um, woman. It felt like, well, some manifested, but some kind of, it's off. Um, I think I don't, it's not my, you know, their attitude or kind of their nose, their height. It's not my type, but I'm willing. I'm willing to give it a try, right? I think that this is, um, it felt like to me, um, it's, it's different from what you expect. Or are you going to receive some news or an event that kind of may uh, maybe a little disappointment to you a uh, five of blades in here ten of blades queen of elixir three of rods and six of blades i think that the universe here is telling you to you will be there um are you going to receive the abundance um it may not be physical but this person kind of have the emotional capability to give you what you want although it's not also manifesting right now now however it is going to manifest in the soonest future in here because i can see that this person somehow you manifested again. Um, I think that there's, there were separations with you, with this person. Queen of Wands and Four of Chalice. Did you just... Someone here kind of made, a, made it clear that I have... I felt for someone then, so there were separations. So that's person A. Person B kind of like waited, praying, right? So they're returning with abundance in here, with emotions. Chariot told you, the death card, and the Ace of Elixir. Kind of, okay. Um, returning with an offer of love. Why, right? It's because that you're not compatible with someone. With a person that you thought is meant for you? Am I a rebound? That could probably... Something that you are thinking. That's why you lost the enthusiasm also. Right? I think I like you before. But what you did to me... Kind of like, uh, it's kind of like minus points. With the eight of... Elixir and the justice. So eight of Elixir, right? Even though that we are apart... My heart still beats for you. Now I wanted to give you the equal give and take and put a smile on your face. But the question is, why did you left me then, right? It's because you feel that you or that person is going to give you more abundance. Um, so kind of like there's a sigh in here. So the zodiac signs that I'm seeing could be a placement in your chart, your person's sun sign, or a placement in their chart. Well, Libra is here, right? Taurus, water placements, Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces, uh, Scorpio, Cancer, Leo, uh, water placements, 
For what I am seeing, Earth signs are also here, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. So this is your reading. Thank you so much. Love and light to you. Namaste. See you in the next reading. Goodbye.